Hey, this judgment awaits with 3 dayrespawncom and I've got the Mass Effect 3 demo downloaded and I'm getting ready to play it. Uh, I'm going to be playing the single player demo and I'll play as a guy. There's the dates that uh, you'll be able to pick up this game. Gives you three different options for your experience. Action is more, I'd say, for people who like the fighting and whatnot. Role playing is kind of in between. I guess that's the normal experience from what I'm reading and then there's a story mode if you're not too much into the fighting so I'm gonna go with the action route though because I like to mix it up at first I didn't really like this option but now that I think about it I kind of do because you know depending on what your play style is and what you like to play you know you can choose that unfortunately you know I wonder if I'm missing out on something by choosing one way or the other but I'm not gonna talk during these cutscenes how bad is it bad we just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts there's something massive on long-range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. Okay, so I bought the first Mass Effect, and I didn't really play it that long because I didn't like the controls on it and how it played out and just seemed a little too involved for me but um, here it is we're going against the reapers I guess they're coming to wipe out all life uh, and here's my issue with the game it just feels like every other game that I've played you know we are fighting some alien who is better than us in every possible way and yet somehow we're gonna make it through and survive I guess I'm just getting the feeling of been there done that um, but this game might have some awesome things in it and totally surprise you. You know, this is just my first impression. Uh, what do you guys think so far? Commander. You're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The Defense Committee wants to see you. Sounds important. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. Anderson? Admiral? You look good, Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. It's the Reapers. And we're not ready for them. Not by a long shot. Tell that to the Defense Committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the Committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. We've all reviewed your report, seen the data you've collected. But it's all just theory to us. You've been there, in the trenches, fighting them. You know what they're capable of. That why they grounded me? Took away my ship? You know that's not true. What you've done? Any other soldier would have been tried, court-martialed, and discharged. It's your knowledge of the Reapers that kept that from happening. That, in your good word? Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. Anderson? Shepard. Ashley? Lieutenant Commander? How'd it go in there? I can never tell with them. I'm just waiting for orders now. Admiral? Come on. You know the Commander? I used to.
Admiral Anderson. Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are. More powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us. And they'll never take pity on us. But... There must be some way. Each of us has to be willing to die to save humanity. Anything less, and they've already won. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? It couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. from Admiral Hackett. What do we do? The only thing we can. We fight, or we die. We should get to the Normandy. Is that you? What's your status? I can't raise the normal. You'll have to contact me. We'll meet you at the landing zone. Anderson up. Okay, so apparently they totally destroyed our fleet like it was nothing. I don't know why they just don't sit up in outer space and just aerial bombard us and totally destroy us, but <laughs> that wouldn't make it very fun. So this, I guess, is to get you used to the controls and everything like that. And I will say that um, compared to the first Mass Effect, I never played the second one, but compared to the first, I like these controls a lot better. And it feels more like a uh, good shooter type game which I, I struggled with that like I said with the first one uh, but I'm not gonna be able to show you much of the content uh, because I only get to show 10 minutes on 3DR's YouTube page but check out mine and I'll show you the actual fighting that comes on just after this so check out I'll, I'll make sure I put a link or uh, something that you can click on to check out that fighting scene and everything like that but also let me know what you think about Mass Effect um, obviously I'm not an expert on Mass Effect so tell me what I need to know and whatnot and what you're thinking about getting this because I know this game is hugely popular so I'm thinking about it uh, I like the controls like I said the graphics look great, that's no surprise. I like the ability to customize your character or possibly play as a woman, but and give them special abilities that are different. Uh, one thing that causes me concern is the mature 17 rating and the list partial nudity. I, you know, I'm not familiar with these games. I don't know what that entails. I don't know if that's a guy with the shirt off or what. So if you do know what that entails, though, um, let me know. I hope it's nothing more than something like that. But there it is. Um, as always, though, take care and God bless.